welcome back to another thrift haul. Today I'm just going to be showing you a bunch of my favorite things that I've picked up over the last few months and I'm probably going to split it into two parts because it's a lot of stuff. So I'm going to start now and we're going to start with shirts and I mainly want to start with shirts because <laughs> I found this one <laughs> and I actually laughed about this for like a good solid five minutes and <laughs> ah! it says one cool daddy-o and it's just kind of like this 50s styled kind of shirt. <laughs> I love dad jokes. Please leave dad jokes in the comments. The next thing is this Hard Rock Cafe tank top, but what's so awesome about it is just like this leopard, like velvet or fuzzy lining around the edge of it. And I think that that is pretty sick. Also, a lot of these items are going to be going up on my Depop shop, which is Lilith45. So you can follow me there and I will be posting a lot of these things that I show you, so if you like any of them, you can purchase them for yourself. I mean, how cool is that? I found this really awesome faded Corvette oversized graphic t-shirt, and I am so happy about it because I wouldn't say that I'm like, I don't know too much about cars, but I've really been learning a lot about, like, different types of cars and, like, models and stuff, which reminds me I need to show you something. Okay, this is not a shirt, but I almost forgot to put it in this haul. So, it is a poster that I found at the thrift store for a dollar so it, it just has like all the different kinds of Corvette models and like all the different kinds of years so it says like 1962 all the way going up to 1990 as far as I can see and I've been waiting to open this up till I was on camera because I um, found this like a month ago and I've been dying to open it and put it up on my wall because like I am obsessed with old cars like my dream car is a wood panel station wagon from like the 70s or the 80s and I'm everyone gives me crap about it but like I love wood paneling everyone thinks it's so ugly but I appreciate the heck out of it and I would love to have like an old Corvette and just like, I have just really been kind of developing an appreciation for cars and I can't wait to open this. I have been absolutely dying to open this and the moment is here. Oh my God, here we go, here we go. starts in 1953 and goes to 1990 and it's just like all the different kinds of makes speaking of cars um i found lightning mcqueen and his squad um which is just so sick um this is just another great find right here and then not cars but motorcycles. Um, I found this really rad Harley Davidson shirt. It's got flames everywhere, which is so cool. And then flames on the back with the logo. So I know everybody is like really into Harley Davidson right now, which I don't blame them. The next thing I got is a sweater vest, but um, it's kind of like a cropped sweater vest. And I really dig the colors. I kind of get like unit vibes from this. 
This next find is a total gem. It's the Polo Jeans Company Ralph Lauren like ribbed sweater in red with the American flag on it. And it's just like really, really nice and heavy. This next shirt is just like really simple reasons for why I like it. It's just like it has these stripes on the arm and like on the armpit. And I just like it. This next sweater is one of like the most epic sweaters I've ever found and it's this like rainbow um, sweater and it's got just like rainbows everywhere. It's got rainbows on the sleeves, rainbows on the bottom, rainbows on the collar, rainbows on the zipper. It's just like super <laughs> super epic. This next shirt is this one and I honestly just kind of love the way that it's like cut and it's tight and it's got like this really cool design here and it just kind of gives me like 2000s -y kind of vibes. This next shirt is pretty sick and it's a NASCAR racing t-shirt and it's super oversized and awesome so if you like NASCAR go check out my Depop shop. This next shirt is a personal fave, and it's a fireball shirt. <laughs> um, I just think it's, it's just great, and that's all I have to say. This shirt is a total gem because I love Strawberry Shortcake. She's my girl. Uh, my favorite book as a kid was the Strawberry Shortcake book, and it's a strawberry shortcake. Life is delicious, and strawberry is all glittery and I'm trying to figure out how weird it would be for me to wear this because I know that I already look like I'm 12 but that is just gonna maximize the 12-ness and this is the last shirt it is this striped sweater um but what is so epic about it is in the front of it it's got this little flower charm that dangles down. It's so cute. Like, I love that. I love it. Next, we're going to move on to bottoms. And the first one I want to show you is this camo skirt. Um, it's got, like, really cool pockets. It's like a cargo skirt. And it's a camo camo cargo skirt. The next thing is this denim skirt. Um, it's got like interesting patching lines on it which kind of gives it like a little bit more of a flare and it actually fits me really nicely. And then the last pants I got are these like really awesome jeans. It's kind of like the really like 2000s-y raver girl kind of style which i am so into so i picked up these jeans next category is sweaters and i'm gonna start speeding things up because the sun is setting really fast so um i found this tasmanian devil sweater and it says tasmania and it's got taz on there this is a total find it is this black hoodie but it's got red and on the sleeves it's got like flames and skulls and snakes and on the pockets it's got flames and on the sleeves it's got more skulls and snakes and flames and that's just like what everybody loves right now and it is a find. I then found this adorable Winnie the Pooh and Piglet too sweater and I freaking I love Winnie the Pooh so much and I think this would be so cool cropped or something the last sweater slash jacket that I'm going to show you is this amazing shearling corduroy jacket um it's literally like straight off of that 70s show which is my favorite show not ever, but like, you know, like one of them. 
so I guess it's one of my favorite shows but like it's really up there and um it's so so cool and it fits me really well which I am really grateful for <coughs> next category is dresses and things I guess it's not really dresses but like full body things and firstly, I found these brown corduroy overalls with this Tweety embroidering, and it's totally epic. It's got Looney Tunes, like the Looney Tunes logo on the bum, and it's super cool. The only sad thing about them is that they're way too small, so that is a, a real bummer then this dress is probably like one of the coolest dresses that I've ever found at the thrift store and it's this um like black and red um like flowery straight across spaghetti strap um everything that I've been looking for in a dress is finally here then i found some more overalls and i love that they have like these really big buttons on them and i am going to florida next week and i'm gonna wear those because i can when it's not freezing cold next category is going to be accessories and the first thing i want to show you is this freaking adorable winnie the pooh watch and it's just got winnie the pooh on it and little bees everywhere and i love the green and blue color combo then i also found these really cool like 2000s kind of unify sunglasses and they have like a blue tint so they make everything blue and I think it's pretty sick then I found these star earrings these star earrings these star earrings with glitter and then I found these star earrings so I like stars. Okay, the story behind these is a ridiculous one. And I think I still have footage of my reaction to the ridiculous coincidence that happened. Um, so I'll probably play that now. And then this was just not my day for earrings. I was so sad. I found this super, super cute, adorable butterfly earring and i lost one like i don't know where it went uh, it might have like fallen off the little thing or something and i was so sad um but are you kidding me Wow, that is so weird. Um, okay, well, I was gonna say that I got the same earrings. I found them in blue, which is my preferred color, and I was really excited about it, but now I literally lost the blue one. Like, it, it, it's not here. So now, <laughs> I guess I just have like a missing blue one and a missing pink one? That is so bizarre. Like, I, what the heck? I'm so confused. What is with butterfly earrings? Oh, they flew away. That's the answer. So yeah, I literally now have two different colored butterfly earrings, which I'm okay with. Like, I'm someone that doesn't really care. Like, I will rock two different earrings. It's all good. But like, how freaking weird is that? Like, I literally lost both of them separately at two different times. Like, it's so weird to me. 
Then I found these really awesome fish earrings and I just feel like this is a really good way to describe my fashion. Uh, ridiculous. The first hat that I found is this really fluffy hat and it's so soft and I believe that this brand is actually like a really good brand that they sell in like Urban Outfitters and stuff. So that's pretty sick. I found this red beret. Um, everybody is so into berets right now. And I was actually really surprised that I found a red one. Like, I don't, I don't know how that happened, but it did. Then I found this really cool fuzzy leopard hat kind of thing. I don't know if it's a bucket hat, um, but it's pretty cool. Then I found a little black fuzzy bucket hat. And then I found two newsboy caps. This one's like houndstooth pattern and this one's just like your regular um, newsboy cap color. And um, they're super on trend right now. And here's the proof that you can find what you need at the thrift store. And lastly, but possibly most importantly, is this red fuzzy hat. Um, I kind of am obsessed with this hat. Um, and that's all I have to say. Next thing is this really, really sick 101 Dalmatians clear mini backpack. And it's just like, so awesome and there isn't even much to say about it because that just like speaks for itself because it's just like really cool this little thing is so cool it's um a powerpuff girls like aluminum tin kind of thing and it says saving the world before bedtime and it's got all of them on here it's got like really awesome flowers all around it and inside we have more earrings um, I found these really cool Spongebob earrings uh, it's him when he's screaming that he's a goofy goober and they're so awesome and then I also found this other Winnie the Pooh watch and it's um, like leather and it's blue and red and it's really cute. And lastly for this category, I found these like really awesome primary colored cups and I actually have four of them, but my other two are in use right now. And they're just like so cool. I love the design on them and the colors of them. I'm a cup fly. Next category is shoes, and literally this entire bag is shoes. I feel like I really scored with the shoes lately, which I feel like never happens, but it, look how dark it is. Uh, oh my God. First thing I found are these really cool, like chunky heeled slip-ons, and they have just like a really cool pattern on it. And I love the little flower. Then secondly, I found these really cool like 70s styled Steve Madden boots. And I was looking at these and I wasn't really sure if I was gonna get them or not. But then this lady walked up to me and she was like, she was like, those are so you. Like I look at you and I look at these and I think that's you. And I was like, huh. <laughs> Thank you so much. And she was talking to me about how they're like Steve Madden and stuff. And then she talked to me into getting them. So I got them. And this is for you, lady at the thrift store. She was so nice. I feel like I see her there all the time. And I just, she's always like so positive and she just like radiates happiness. And I love her. <laughs> I don't know who she is, but I love her. But yes, I got these these um two pairs of shoes are painted by me and i just kind of like made them like color blocked primary colors that kind of thing 
super 80s, 90s. These next two shoes are gonna be like super 2000s-y, like cyberpunky, raver girl kind of thing. And I am really into it. And they are these like hella chunky, like sneakers. They have like such a thick um, bottom and the inside is plaid. And they're just like so epic and so like gothy and i am all about that and then these ones are so so cool but i wish that they fit me they're like way too big but they're like these really chunky platforms and they've got like this really cool um like flower stitching and like they're really strappy and they're just like <laughs> they're like the style of me but I, they don't fit me and it's so sad but they're so cool and these will definitely be up on my depop shop so if you're a size nine you need these okay down to the last item it's so dark right now and i'm sorry but um so i found this thing and it's kind of like a bundle of just like those holiday stamps or stickers where it's like, oh, two blah, blah, blah from blah, blah, blah. And I literally, I saw there's like Winnie the Pooh stickers and Looney Tunes stickers and just like some normal stickers, which um, I also love because um, something that I'm kind of trying to do with my channel is like show that you can get so many things secondhand and you don't need to buy them new um, because not only is it cheaper but it's more eco-friendly so I just kind of try to buy a lot of my things secondhand so these will come in handy for years to come but I don't know what is all in here so I figured I would open it up it's kind of like a mystery bag and I'm really excited so let's see what's in here so first we've got some looney tunes stickers and then we have some winnie the pooh stickers love that that's pretty much why i got it <laughs> um some more winnie the pooh stickers some more winnie the pooh stickers some more Ooh, Chip and Dale stickers. Aw, some more Winnie the Pooh stickers. Mmm, some more Winnie the Pooh. And then some of these in here are more Winnie the Pooh and then more just like regular stickers. And I literally got this entire pack for $2. Um, so I get all of these really awesome stickers that I can use for two dollars and then also I'm reusing them I guess no one used these in the first place but like you can just find so much stuff at the thrift store that you can reuse and save it from going to the landfill and repurpose things so I am so excited to put these on all of my holiday presents and stuff for my family and my friends so I am going to end the video now. It is crazy dark in my room and I'm sorry for that. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to comment down below what your favorite item in this thrift haul was. Don't forget to follow my Depop um, because you'll see so much of this stuff on there. And hopefully I will see you guys soon. I know that I am being really bad at uploading, but I'm trying. Okay.